Alright, there's going to be a penalty on the play. It's going to go to Surrey. There's a big shot there that goes just wide. Rhodes with it on the point. Playing that over to the far side. Garrett. Gets that one. And big to there. The opportunity to go. Ridge Meadows strikes first. 1 0 in this one. Marshall. How long did that puck? Just a little longer than I think most people would be comfortable with. But Ridge Meadows is going to move it up now. Poor help. Walks over the blue line, makes a nice spin move. That's going to be picked up here. Sending past the goal. Nice play. There's a big assist for Amsler. I think found Pryor. Pryor will throw that on that. It'll be hitting the body in front. Won't make its way through. Now here goes Boyle. Sending pass there. Another opportunity to goal. Pryor is going to pick that one up. Marvelous puck movement by the Ridge Meadows Flames. You can see a bit of frustration creeping into the Knights game as they're going for the hit at every opportunity. Denberg's going to throw that in there. It's in. A deflection there. I believe that's McKay who made the tip. Found its way past the mean Kent. And once again on the power play, the Flames capitalize to make it 4 nothing with 14 seconds remaining in this one in this first period. Nyan, moving it forward. Duff, back to Nyman. Over to the point. Big shot. There, a good goal there. Sitting on the doorstep. Another power play goal. Makes this a 5 nothing Ridgeback Baicha. And it's tough to win games shorthanded, point blank. Is it hurt? Shot there from Garrett's an absolute laser beam. Over top of the right shoulder of Naveen Kent. And that'll make it 6 nothing for Ridge Meadows. How this thing will end. With the Flames taking a 6 nothing victory into Surrey. Back-to-back -back shutouts for LA Marshall.